Couple Buy in LA, and so today we introduce you to yet another set of Couple Buy in performers. Actually, this guy you've met many times before. I'm talking about Chris Serna along with his wife, Celeste. Hello, and welcome to Couple Buy in LA. Both of you, welcome back to the to, on the show. Hi, thank, thank you, you so much for having us. Ayan, of course, <laughs> and right now they are going to talk about their new band called. The Chris Serna Trio. The Chris Serna Trio. And rounding up the trio is to my left, Tony. Hello and welcome to Cabo Bay in L.A. Thank you. Chris, the last time you were here, you were with another band. So is this a new band? Do you? How many bands do you have? <laughs> um, I, I'm actually in three different bands right now. Mm -hmm. uh, and playing what kinds of all sorts of music? Uh, with this one, the Chris Serna Trio, we're primarily uh, jazz standards. And then we have the bluegrass band that was here two years ago. Mm -hmm. And then I'm also playing in a swing band. Tony is actually a drummer. Tony, tell us mm -hmm. how you formed this band. How did you um, get together? Well, Chris and I met um, back in 2005. Um, he came out from Hawaii, and uh, and we got we got together. He he was doing a concert, and he needed a drummer. And so we've been playing. Um, all, every time that he uh, was in town, now that he's here uh, permanently, can't get rid of me now. Yeah, yeah, I can't get, <laughs> ri I can't, get, I can't get rid of him now. So I mean, we we figured might as well form a you know. right, right. <laughs> no, well, no, no, no. Ser seriously, we uh, we um, love playing together. And Chris is an awesome pianist, and uh, we're playing with Celeste. She's getting really, she's getting really good on the bass. So right. Very happy. Wonderful musicians. Chris and Tony are both blind, but it's not—it's not, it's not uh, an obstacle to making beautiful music, correct, Chris? Oh, definitely. Mm -hmm. um, what about you, Tony? When did you start playing uh, drums? I started playing when I was about uh, 10 years old. Mm -hmm. And like Celeste and Chris, who are uh, full-time musicians, are you also full-time musicians? I am. I do. I do. Um, Performing, but I also am a teacher. I oh. teach every um, Saturday at the Academy of Music for the Blind. That's over in Monrovia, and that's a and that's a lot of fun. I teach percussion and uh, braille music there. You can actually use it to your advantage. Sometimes they say because um, your other senses get really, really developed. And when you're, you know, you don't have the sense of sight, you, maybe the sense of hearing is something that's really developed in you guys. Do you think, uh, Chris? What was that again? Oh, <laughs> it works to your advantage. I'm just kidding. No, well, um, I don't know. That's what they all say. But for me personally, because I've been playing a lot of music and sometimes, especially when you have uh, I'm not talking about Tony, but when we have a loud drummer, uh -huh. uh, it does I'm tend to. Uh, <laughs> I, I hope no, not. it's not. No. <laughs> but uh, you know, the hearing tends to get a little bit messed up. But right. Uh, yeah. But it's not well, Tony's fault. No. no <laughs> thank, you, thank, you, thank you. Thank you. Celeste, <laughs> uh, what kind of different music? No. Uh, mm -hmm. This trio, you're playing mostly jazz, jazz standards. standards. And then the last time you were here, you're also part of that group band. You know, so I, I can just imagine that your life is just filled with music. Yes, yeah, definitely. What, what's, the what's the benefit? What's the benefit? to having music every day. Music is what you breathe and eat. <laughs> That's why I wake up every morning. He's always practicing. So every time, all day he's um, playing music. There's music in the house. It, it's it's very uplifting. And mm. I guess it, music is within me since I was a child because mm -hmm. I always, I was a choir in church and, you know, everything is like about music for mm -hmm. me. But I just didn't pursue the passion but now that I married somebody that's you're a married to a musician now <laughs> you can so pursue lucky. both your love and your passion right yes. and um, this group congratulations because you're actually launching an album yes, tell us are. about it Chris well we're very excited to uh, launch our first album as a group um, it's called just jamming mm -hmm. and that's um, actually we we are uh, with the privilege of working with a wonderful friend who's also a vocalist he's a jazz vocalist mm -hmm. his name is JJ Johnson yeah. and uh, so I we like to call this group it's a pretty interesting combina combination we got two blind guys <laughs> uh, a girl and as JJ wants to put it uh, a grumpy old Englishman <laughs> don't say <laughs> that but here is a sample of their music thank you once again congratulations a sample of music from Chris Cerna trio
like he thought that everything was on the square. But he tried to throw the monkey from his back. The monkey grabbed the buzzer's neck, said, listen, Jack, straighten up and fly back. Straighten up and stay right. Straighten up and fly right. Cool down, Baba, don't you blow your top water. Ain't no use in diving. What's the use of diving? Straighten up and fly right. 